The digital age we're in calls for hero leaders, people who are willing to make bold decisions in times of uncertainty. This could be, this could include, I should say, um, perhaps shedding certain business positions or staking out new mar markets or verticals. And at the same time, leaders need to have the humility to acknowledge what they don't know and to bring on board people with potentially very different skills, also different backgrounds and capabilities. They need to be willing to learn from others that may have less leadership tenure, but more relevant insights. And they need to be highly inclusive and great listeners to understand not only new technologies, but also a way of doing things that are different than how they did it before. And you know, for years, I've told my team that uh, the executives that are our most successful clients are those that I consider to be humble rock stars. And these are people that understand their talents and they have complete confidence in their abilities to make a big impact, no matter what company they land in. Really, the only thing I see that's holding them back is that they are extremely uncomfortable with selling themselves or tooting their own horn. And this even includes those people that have been searching for a job for a long time. And if they've had no luck in the job market, that can really wear on their self-esteem. But they never seem to lose faith in their abilities. And most of the time, it turns out that their lack of response from decision makers is simply because they haven't focused on clarifying their personal brand to paint a very clear picture of their capabilities, coupled with filling their days performing the right activities. And usually, they're going through the motions doing the same things that they did earlier in their career. And these are basically three things that a humble rock star is doing that I can see. And number one is really looking at the job boards and applying for jobs online. And then number two is reaching out to recruiters and trying to capture their attention, which can be a little bit difficult. And uh, if you've been uh, searching, you probably know this. And, and then finally, they're asking their colleagues, they're asking friends and family, anyone they know and trust, uh, if they know of anybody who's hiring. And unfortunately, when you look for a position paying six figures or multiple six figures, the search activities that are most effective are completely different than what you might have done in years past. So I have a question for you. Do you count yourself uh, as a humble hero? And I'd love for you to tell me in the comments section. I'd be very interested. Part of this information, and, and really the concept of a humble hero, is described in a recent book that I recommend by Blair Shepard called 10 Years to Midnight. And I hope this information has served you in your career search. And if it resonates with you, I'd love to have a conversation and, and with you and, and let you in on the current executive job market, maybe give you an estimate on your marketability in the open job market if you're considering searching. All right, so I hope this, again, I hope this information has helped you. I'm Tammy Cabell with Career Resume Consulting. Thanks for watching.